And, uh, and again, like I mentioned, what configurations we offer, uh, engine choices, avionics choices, and then, of course, uh, landing gear configurations. The original SAM airplane design was, was designed with three different wing sets, uh, a shorter aerobatic wing, a longer uh, light sport, and, uh, and, I, and I believe a, uh, an in-between wing for, for a little bit higher gross weight. So, uh, again, we're evaluating all those on the engineering side and then see where we'll, we'll ultimately go with that. For me personally, I learned to fly at this airport in 1991, and this time of the year too, is, uh, I think it was February and March, and so uh, this is not completely foreign to me, this cold stuff. Like I mentioned, this airplane has the Rotax 912 100 horsepower engine, which is probably, you know, for this size of an airplane in this configuration, I would say probably the, on the minimal power side. Still performs really quite well. It's a nice lightweight engine, and the fuel burn is always very uh, economical with the Rotax. But uh, I know one of the engines, or we'll be looking at some larger engines as well. Like Roger said, it's a pretty clean airplane, so we can really pick up some additional speed by going with larger engines on this airplane, so that's something that... Uh, We'll definitely be looking at in the future. Steerable nose wheel on this configuration, as you can see, and as Roger just showed, the airplane will basically turn turn uh, on a dime. Uh, the steering system is very similar to the Zenith uh, airplanes, except that it's not direct linkage on the rudder pedal. It's a, there's a dampener in there, so but uh, it seems to be a really quite effective system. As we can also see, we're sitting quite a bit higher above the wing than we are, say, in the 650, our low-wing uh, airplane. But it's a little bit different configuration, and I was surprised that uh, even though we're sitting quite a bit, quite a bit differently, that uh, the landing configuration is really quite similar. We don't have a feeling that we're sitting much higher above the ground than in the other airplanes. And the advantage with sitting higher up is the visibility is actually really quite nice. Uh, even in the back seat here, uh, we can see where the location of the of the wing. We our forward visibility and low wing visibility is quite good. And where Roger is sitting up front, uh, again the downward visibility, especially for a, for a low wing airplane, is really excellent. Excellent visibility, yes.